Hey there, Matt here. I want to give you a rundown of the T15 Super Mini. Now, the T15 Super Mini, basically, it's designed to get into, obviously, very, very tight spots. This one, in particular, has the optional 4-in-1. It normally comes just with a uh, mud bucket on it, which makes the machine um, uh, narrower. There's an upgrade. It's, it's a couple of grand to upgrade to the 4-in-1. Uh, it makes the machine wider at 850 um, compared to 780 how it is. So if you really, really want a tight area, you step down to the, the um, smaller machine. If you come in closer here, have a look under the um, under the hood, I guess you'd say, you've got your oil cooler. The engine's a Briggs & Stratton engine, um, which is pretty decent. So engine, obviously everyone's heard of Briggs & Stratton. I can quickly just undo this. You can see your, your oil tank and um, all your other bits and pieces in there. It's probably not coming out as fast as I would like because you've got to unscrew this, right? And I'm going to swing this open for you, and then you're going to see in there, while, while I'm unscrewing this, you'll see the um, uh, hydraulics, the auxiliary hydraulics, the triple circuit there, and your good quality fittings there as well. Um, honestly, they're a great machine. If you want to carry a bit more weight, if you want a little bit more weight, then you generally would go to a T25 or a T30, but these are good for really, really narrow spots. And I probably should have um, unscrewed this a little bit more earlier on. And then we go, we take it right out, and we swing this around, you can see behind the oil cooler, you've got your thermo fans there. There's a switch, uh, your pump, back of the engine, battery's all easy to access. That's so really, really one screw and you can get in behind everywhere and keep it, keep it a, um, a good close eye on it, make sure it's clean, all that sort of stuff, right? Um, check the oil down there as well. It's real pretty easy, pretty easy to sort. Your um, fuse box there, horn, et cetera, et cetera, all your other bits and pieces, right? So, right, there it goes. I'll just sit that back down there. Um, and then let's put this straight back in here for a tick and we'll have to make sure we do it all up later. I'm going to be sitting here ages while you're watching me bloody put a screw in. Um, drop the hood down. Basically it just comes around and latches straight in pretty easy. Straight in there. Um, as far as controls go, um, your controls are pretty straightforward. Fire it up. Battery meter, your cooling fans. So you can, you can turn on for your, um, uh, what's the name, your driving lights as well, in case you get stuck in the paddock in the middle of the night. Hour meter, amp meter, and the horn works, right? Starts easy. Being a petrol engine, it's a little bit noisier, okay? Throttle-wise, throttle's down there. You know, I'm six foot four, fit on it pretty easy. And then front and forwards easy. Your hand controls. Drives nice and easy. Obviously I'm only driving it around the factory. It's the narrow as as narrow as you can. You get the idea. Obviously it works, right? But you it's as narrow as you can go. Um, before you start going to tracks, right? So this comes in at 780, um, whereas the, um, the um, sorry, 730, whereas the, the um, T25 comes in a bit wider because it's, it's caused the tracks. It's a similar sort of configuration. Um, obviously you can do it on trailer packages. It's a totally separate page for the actual trailer package. So uh, if you're interested, probably best way of dealing with it is um, contact us at our office at Digger King. Give us a call on our 1300 number, or alternatively, if you prefer, if you prefer, um, go to diggerking.com.au, fill in the step three form. End of the day, these are also part of our super mini combos as well, which you can have a look at, um, which is basically a 3900 long trailer. It's got a 1.1 super mini on it, and then also the T15 super mini and a whole heap of implements. Really great, um, a very good niche, especially if you're any, in any, any heavy built up area. Literally for um, a reasonable size chunk of change, you can just hook it to the back of a vehicle, um, tow it with any tow four wheel drive that can go up to 3490 with the whole um, 3900 package, and then where you go, and this will be part of it. Or you can have this machine by itself, um, the price is below, or alternatively on the trailer, whichever one you prefer. Anyway, I um, hope that makes sense. Looking forward to helping you make contact with us. If you want finance, we can help you sort that out. Easy as, and look forward to helping you.